I start by loosening all of the jib bolts to remove the existing blade. Once the blade's out, I'll loosen the jib bolts up just a little bit more to give a little bit more space for dropping the new blade in. Um, there's springs underneath, so I push the blade down against the springs to eyeball the projection, and then slightly snug down the two outer jib screws to hold the blade in place. Uh, I then set the dial indicator up, zero it off of the cutter head, and adjust one side at a time, uh, tapping that side down. I do have to loosen up the outer jib bolts just a hair more to be able to get the blade to slide down easily so I don't have to tap it too hard. Um, once I'm good on one side, I'll sw swap the dial indicator to the other side, tap that side down until I get the read that I want, and then go back and check the first side over once again. Usually there's one or two thousandths that needs to be adjusted. Once that side's good, I'll snug down all of the jib bolts, and I'm on to the next blade.